Hey friends, this is Wilson Stevens Realtor and welcome to Walnut Creek. Welcome to another episode of Community Showcase. I'm Wilson Stevens Realtor. I'm here with Derek White, one of the franchise owners of Clean Juice. Hi, Derek. How's it going? Pretty good. How about yourself? Good. I am so excited to be here. I really think there was a need for a place like yours to, to, to come to the orchards. And me and my wife actually patron your, your place a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, we get that a lot, too. So tell us about your background and why the health service industry and why you became a franchise owner of Clean Juice. I served in the military for six years. When I got out in 2008, I really thought about owning my own business, but the market wasn't that great back then, so I found a really strong, uh, really good job. And through that experience, I found that I had a great passion for helping other people. At some point in time through that, working there at that job, I realized it's time for me to, to take over my own business. My sister and I partnered, found Clean Juice, immediately believed and loved what, what they were about, so we hopped on it. Before my wife and I moved to Annie, I mean to Walnut Creek, um, never had allergies. And as soon as we moved here, it's just been the hardest thing to do, like our whole family, that's been the hardest. So you're saying that if, if we stick to a, a juice diet, that that could be beneficial for us? The allergies that I experienced throughout my whole life, my eyes would swell shut, I'd lose hearing in some of my ears. And, my nasal congestions would, would just plug up. Well, roughly five years ago, I started juicing at home with a masticating juicer, and I fell in love with it. I bought it for my wife, but I was the one who used it the most. I was juicing every day, a mason jar size full of uh, juice, and didn't have allergies at all. No allergies. So I, I really preach juicing is healthy for you, and it's very important. So in terms of being a franchise owner, what are the qualifications of, of owning a clean juice, is there a process that the owner has to follow in order to, to be qualified for? You go through a vetting process to see if it's what you want and it's it, it's a good fit between the company and you. But yes, you go through each step, learning the process from pressing the juice to making the toast. How to clean and how to... Yeah, yeah. How, to, how to do everything. We still do it to this day. Megan and I, my sister, my business partner, um, we still preach, we all do the same things. We'll clean, we'll make sure we get our hands dirty, and we're here with our employees hand and foot. So. That's awesome. So what are some of the specialties that you offer that's different from other juiceries? So the biggest specialty that we offer is our CCOF, uh, California Certified Organic Farms certification. Their, their program is what comes in, vets us, make sure that from the table backwards to the farm, we're organic. Now, are there any like programs that you have some of your customers follow? Like, like if I want to do a cleanse or if I, I have an allergy problem, are there certain programs that you can kind of guide us to? to... Yeah, so we have, we have several different cleanses. Um, we have one to six day cleanses, which is another specialty that we offer. And all those cleanses and all the juices that we bottle are pressed in house. So that, that eliminates the pasteurization that if you were to go to the store and buy a juice, that pasteurization, it, we don't do that here. It's fresh, the enzymes are fresh, the, the minerals and everything in the juice is, is, is all fresh and it lasts four to seven days. And then we have a juice uh, cleanse club that we just started up uh, several months ago. So, and yeah, we'll, we'll work. We have, a, we have a, a nifty book that'll help us with the customers, show them like the importance and the highlights of juicing. So one of the things me and my wife noticed is that you also had food items on the menu. So our menu, it, it's a pretty broad menu. It goes from regular over-the-counter juice to smoothies, protein smoothies. Uh, we have acai bowls, four different kinds of toasts. Uh, four different wraps, and then we have salads, which we call greenwa bowls, because it has quinoa. We add quinoa to them. How important is shopping local to you? To me, the biggest part about shopping local is you're reinvesting into the community. It provides jobs for the community. We chose Walnut Creek because it was more of a centralized location. Uh, Clean Juice is pretty new as far as the franchise goes. They started up in 2014, and they're from the East Coast. And the goal in, is to, to expand if we can and, and bring more organic produce organic options for a quicker delivery system to the community. 
What are some of the favorite, your favorite restaurants here to patron in Walnut Creek? So I'm a big fan of Sourdough & Co. I like going there. I really like their sandwiches. I was going there frequently during construction. Yeah. Jack's Urban Eats. We have Juice Boosters, which have helped us market since before opening and during opening. Elevate, which is a basketball coach that helps youth through basketball training. We have uh, Lululemon is helped out. Mama Let, which is a mom's, a mom's group that'll come here every so often and spread the word about clean juice. So what do we have here? Uh, this is one of our wraps. It's the Kelly wrap, one of the fan favorites. And then we have a protein toast, which is avocado, hard boiled egg, lemon and sea salt. So this is a so basic smoothie, banana, strawberries, almond milk, almond butter, and it's maple syrup. This is the energy one. It's a juice. It's got uh, ginger, beets, orange, apple, and carrots. Uh, it's really good to take before a gym workout. Yeah. Well, Derek, I want to thank you for taking thank the you. time to, to meet with me today. This has been awesome. I'm really happy that you're here in the community. Make sure that you guys come support Clean Juice. It's a great community spot. Um, it's in walking distance to many of our neighborhoods here in Walnut Creek. And remember to shop local. Cheers. You got us? Thank you. <laughs> it's a pleasure, man.